this is Let's Play Yu-Gi-Oh! Master Duel Blind. By Floodmod14. Uh, hey guys, Floodmod14 oh, here. And we're back with some more good old Let's Play Master Duel. Uh, one thing I did want to show you guys real quick here. Uh, let's see, it should be right here, right here. Yeah, check this out. Uh, uh, someone, um, uh, Serenity Spider Monkey, actually sent me this um, on Twitter uh, in between, because I'm recording, you know, a nice batch of like five or so episodes tonight. But yeah, uh, they Serenity Spider Monkey sent this in. This is a uh, box art from, uh, as you can see, like a VHS uh, cover, yeah, yeah, check it out, like, check out the cover, you got Perfect Machine King, Serenity, there on the right, and Yugi there, like, I've never seen this before, and, um, I guess this was the Japanese, oh, obviously, but, like, yeah, yeah, like, I, I, some of these moments are just iconic, like, you can remember that, and, like, of course, you know, oh, no, I'm falling, 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 but, yeah, yeah, uh, I've never seen, uh, and this I remember, uh, where Jinzo, uh, some of the wristwatch thing, like the watch tranquilizer, that was a fun scene in r Virtual World. But I've never known Serenity to appear on the cover art of anything Yu-Gi-Oh! related, so that's pretty cool. Uh, yeah, decent, pretty good art overall. I, I like it, I really like it. Um, but, uh, yeah, anyway... This is Yu Gi Oh! Master Duel Blind! And, uh, yeah, last time we opened some packs, uh, you know, gonna wait about, eh, about two weeks or so for you guys to submit what structure deck you want me to get. In the meantime, in between time, let's, uh, select our Synchro of Unity deck. Okay, and, uh, let's go here, let's go to, let's try some duels today. Now, in between episodes, I kind of transferred the, uh, uh, the files, obviously, off of my phone and everything. So let's just go uh, here and let's see if we can get into some duels. Synchro of Unity? All right. It's time. It's time to get your game on. Let's duel. Uh, yeah, let's do it. All right. Uh, there was some kind of warning message here. I, I guess we can't get ranks right now, or I don't know. I don't. I don't really mind if we can get ranks or not. I just want to. It's time to do it. Do This guy's got a car for the deck leader. Ooh, the game's is the game lagging a little bit, or is that me? Hmm. First time we've experienced the lag. So far in this Let's Play, all the connection issues have been on the opponents. Ooh, and this hand. Ooh, we bricked. Ooh, no monsters. Ooh, that is not good at all, bro. Well, let's just do what we do, guys. Let's set a couple and in our turn. Wow, yikes. Nah, cancel. Uh, what's this do? Ooh, uh, might be the only way we get a monster. Yeah, let's just set two and pass. Yikes. Yikes, yeah. No monsters. Uh, that is what we call a brick, folks. Happens to the best of us. You know, sometimes you get a bunch of bricks. It's just time to build a nice brick house. Jeez, I brick. House. I better stop singing the song, because copyright infringement. She's a brick. Yeah. <laughs> Mike to my tag, just letting it all hang out. Shake it down, shake it down, down. Shake it down, shake it down, down. Let's see what we're up against here. Luna Light. Ooh. Luna. Ooh, interesting. One thing I do know about Luna Lights these guys can OTK pretty quick. Uh, I hear. Uh, What's the boss monster? Panther Dancer and Leo Dancer. Pretty good cards from what I hear. Uh, so what's funny is, like I said, guys, I haven't really competed in the past, you know, since 2013. So for the past nine years. 
But of course, like all the Yu-Gi-Oh friends I, you know, had, obviously I still talk to those guys and girls. So now some of those people that I'm referencing still compete to this day and have competed, etc. So basically what I guess I'm saying is like, I don't have firsthand knowledge of a lot of these things, but I do remember one friend, um, uh, Erica. I remember she telling me that, uh, yeah, she ran into a Luna Light deck. This was the end, she said. I think this is about like two or three years ago. So in 2019, she said she ran into this Luna Light player because she was at a she was actually at a at a, uh, a qualifier a qualifier, and according to her, she got OTK'd twice back to back. And you know she's she's a good player. I mean Erica's Erica's no slouch. I mean Erica. She's a better player than me, than I ever was competitively, so. And that's the truth, Ruth. But uh, yeah, yeah, for her to say that, I was just like, really? I, I just asked her, did you brick? She was like, no, no, I had great first hands. I just got wrecked. I was like, oh, they're that good, huh? She's like, yeah, yeah, yeah. So it's funny, some names I will recognize, but like I said, until I really know firsthand what they can do, yeah, I'm not really uh, in a position to... Now, what's this do? This is a... What is this? Fire Formation! Tin key. So when this card's activated... Oh. Uh, so right now, all it's doing is get, giving 100 attack. And that's not really worth an MST in my book. But I will set this card... I don't know, maybe Luna Lights have some kind of equip card. So I'll set uh, MST here. Let's set it over here in the far most zone. And let's just end our turn, yeah. Looks like uh, this player's taking it easy on us. From, from I mean, if, if what Erica told me is true, yeah, this player's taking it easy on us. I don't know, maybe they're afraid of our face downs or something, but yeah, yeah. Because <laughs> according to her, according to Erica, she got a riggedy, riggedy wreck, son. All right, and that should be the end of this duel if they go all in. Now let's check out this card, White Rabbit. So when normal summon, you can target. So what's it doing right now? You can target, oh. That's pretty good. No way for us to stop that, so... Pretty good. Pretty good. Yep. And so this card comes back. Uh-huh. And this will let her... Yep. Okay. Alrighty. Looks like we might be... Well, I'm pretty sure this is the end of the game. I'm pretty sure. Ooh, throw away Kaleido Chick. I hear this card's really good, really good. So, yeah, this should be the end of the duel, unless like, I don't know, they'd have to do something really, really nuts. So, now what's this doing here? Oh, so this card is, oh, return them to the hand. Okay. Wait, wait, wait. One thing I wonder, why wasn't I able to chain MST there? Or did I hit the cancel prompt? I probably hit the cancel prompt. Because I don't think anything is stopping me from activating card effects, right? Uh, no. But I can see how this deck can OTK. Because you saw how we had like three cards in total there on the field. So, and you know, this card bounced them all. Bounced them all. So... Yeah, I can, I can see how this deck can OTK. I see it. I see the light. You need. This on Link 4? It's gotta be, right? Whoa. Try for grade. What is this? Try for grade. Shrike. The ominous one. Oh, the omen. I, I, I thought it said ominous one. Anyway, this is the end of the duel. We tried, guys. We tried. Not really. We, we just... We didn't get anything. We didn't get a monster. We had no chance. And even if we did get a monster... Yeah, I'm gonna 
gonna take Erica's word for it and say we would have lost that anyway. But we did gain some valuable experience, and I got to see how Luna Lights actually work, so that's pretty interesting. Aw, oh, poor Wabbit, poor Wabbit. Alright, so let's go to what you can do during and outside of the tally. What? What does this even mean? I don't even know what this message means, but... What, are we outside of the tallying period? What's... what's going on here? What? Let me just try to back out and... Yeah, because I've never seen that message before, so... Why are we getting this message now? I, I don't know, I don't know. Maybe that message was there the whole time, <laughs> right? I, I, I'll check in editing the first, you know, two episodes with duels and like... Yeah, was that message there the whole time? I don't think so. Anyway, or Dr. Pepper. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Uh, let's go second. I feel like we have a better chance of going second. The extra card is just pretty valuable. Now, hopefully we get matched up against someone with a starter deck, or they just, you know, straight quit. Ah, Junk Synchron. This is the first duel we've drawn Junk Synchron. Pretty interesting. What is this? What is this? What art thou? Whoa! What just happened? What just happened? So he's like revealing some cards? Cross out what? What is that? Anyway. Uh oh, oh, we got some we got a meta deck. We got a meta deck, folks. Well, I can't really do anything here. What's this? We shall soon find out. Ah, getting some tokens, eh? All right, Sangan, wow. Faithful. Hmm. Ah, that seems pretty good. Fossil dig, wow. A lot of searching going on in this deck. A lot of searching, wow. Uh, let's, yeah, let's look in the graveyard here. What did this do? Oh, banish three or six. Oh, it's hauled. Well, obviously, they can't even do damage on the first turn, so that's meaningless. Add one. Oh, cannot draw cards by card effects. Well, that doesn't matter if all you're doing is searching, so yeah. Draco back. Hmm. So you just, you link Sangan off, because then you get Sangan's, yeah. I don't know what deck this guy's playing. Seems pretty good, though. Not gonna lie. What is this? Crusadia Arborium. Link two time. So is this guy link climbing? Is that what this is? This seems familiar. This card right here seems familiar. Jet Synchron, ooh. That seems new. Interesting. Megaphantom Beast! Aurora Wow. Uh-huh, uh-huh, uh-huh. Wow. Pretty good card. Pretty good card, yeah. So let's check out some of these. Let's check out Jet Synchron. Out of all these, I'm most interested in this. That seems really good. Yeah, Jet Synchron seems really good. All right. This guy is going off, son. Like, I have no idea what's happening. But one thing I can tell you, there's a lot of chaining and a lot of special summoning. Yeah, this guy is going ham, bro. Ham. Ham Taro. Yep. Level four synchron. Cupid pitch. Huh. So this is a level five. This is a level five. These are level fours. So this is gonna be a level eight. I see, I see. 
Warlord Savage Dragon. Hmm. This might be a card I was warned about. So, you can remove one Boral counter from this card and negate the activation of your opponent's card. So basically, we can't do anything, because this card has three counters on it, and I'm pretty sure they can use the effect as often as they like, right? Boralod Savage Dragon. Definitely a card we want to try to get ourselves. It's pretty easy to make, from what I can see, so... Yeah, pretty good card. And it is quick effect. Yeah, it is. So. Okay. Good to know. Good to know. Yeah, this card seems pretty darn good. Not gonna lie. Yeah, Savage Dragon. Pretty good. Pretty good. Wait, wait. Is the game stuck? Yeah, because it says one here. Did we lose connection? Or did he lose connection? What's going on here? Uh, clap on. Clap off. The clap. On. Well, guys, I hate to assume, but I think we just avoided getting wrecked. I'm not sure if we lost connection. I, oh, I mean, this, this little guy's moving, the rabbit, so... I think our connection's fine. But the game just like froze. Oh, there it goes, there it goes. Wow, yeah, that was, that was weird. I think that guy almost lost connection. <laughs> How much would that have sucked? This guy's pulling off all these combos and like, yeah, yeah, you can't even connect. That would suck. So, cards can't be added from the main deck to your opponent's hand, except by drawing them. Wow, wow. Pretty interesting, pretty interesting. So, yeah, guys, um, how do we say things aren't looking too hot right now? One thing I will do, though, I'll summon this, Rockstone Warrior, attack mode. <laughs> Let's just see if we can get this guy to do something incredibly stupid. All right, ready? Battle time. I mean, because we've lost this regardless. But let's just attack into uh, Colossus. Let, let, let's, let's see what this guy's got going on here. Okay, so we get two tokens. Or do we? Oh, he's gonna let us? What? Okay, that's kind of surprising. I'm surprised he didn't uh, negate this effect. But we'll take it. Uh, main phase two. Let's set four cards just to see if we can bluff this guy into do something crazy. So, let's set this right here. And we can't use any of these. We can't use any of these, but uh, let's see if we can bluff this guy. And let's set this right here. And let's set this right here. Alrighty, buddy. Your turn. Now let's see how much this guy combos off in his second turn. I'm impressed. So far, I'm impressed. You can't add any cards except by drawing. You get, you can only do what I say, basically. <laughs> that, that's what this card is, Warlord Savage Dragon. Just like, yeah, you can only use your effects if I want you to use them. Uh, and plus he has like a couple continuous cards back here. It's just like, wow. <laughs> uh, yeah, while well, equipped, you can target one card your opponent control, return it to the hand, so he can bounce anything he wants. He can uh, also, ah, yeah, yeah, do some more searching. And plus, this guy's graveyard, pretty loaded. I guarantee you, there's at least one graveyard effect in here. Again, I'm not gonna study it too hard, but yeah. Yep, there goes the bounce, so there's that. Interesting. Alrighty, go for it. I'm surprised we're not gonna... Oh wait, we're gonna lose here, right? No, no, we're still alive? What? How's that possible? That shouldn't be possible. 
but it is. We're still alive. I, unless this guy's going to tremendous fire us. No, no. That's shocking. That is shocking because, like, I didn't really do anything. But, uh, yeah. Anyway. Let's see what we've got here. So, I've got Warrior Returning Alive. Yeah. Can't really do anything. Let's summon Junk Synchron here. Attack mode. Yeah. Anything you want to do, son? What you got? Nothing? All right. We're going to set this card. Right here. Oh, I think I'm having connection issues. According to that? Oh. Yeah, maybe. Maybe it's on me. I don't know. I don't know. The game seemed to do this earlier, but... Oh, it seems fine now. Okay, let's place this here. Limiter overload. And... Let's special summon... Turret Warrior. Attack mode. Uh, Bye-bye, Junk Synchron. See ya. Alrighty. What you gonna do now, son? Now I'll activate the warrior returning alive. I just wanna see if he's gonna negate this. I'll take back my junk synchron, man. Is he gonna let me? I doubt it. I doubt it. <laughs> Come on, man. Negate me. Do it. Be a man and negate it. Ah, he's gonna let it go through. How gentlemanly of him. Alright, battle time! <laughs> Go, turret warrior! Uh, I guess we'll destroy... This? I don't know. Destroy the adventurer token, yeah! I don't think it really matters, but uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Bop, because this card prevents it from being destroyed in battle, right? Uh, yep, first time it is not. Okay. Anyway, I end my turn, man. Go for it. What is this card's effects, anyway? Uh, oh, okay, okay. Nothing really to worry about. So, okay. What you gonna do now, man? Another bounce. Very smart. Took out Turret Warrior. And this should be it. Yeah. I wouldn't see why it's not. Four load Savage Strike. Alrighty. Uh, well, we learned something in that duel. Four load Savage Dragon? Pretty good. Pretty good. Also, some of the Link monsters he was using seem pretty good as well. All right, somehow we still leveled up. Now let's go back to the uh, goals for the day. Let's see if we accomplish them. Missions. Yeah, missions. So we have daily. And... Oh, we just need to activate one more spell card. So let's claim the awards we've got so far. Wow, yeah. 1,050 gems, one legacy pack ticket. Okay, yeah, cool. All right, let's do it. So all we need to do is activate one spell card today, and we are good to go on the daily awards. So, oh yeah, I forgot to do this offline. Uh, 40, oh yeah, I forgot to do that, okay. But I will do that uh, in between episodes. But yeah, we're gonna end this episode here. And in the next episode, we're gonna start it right after this one. We're gonna do one more duel and try to activate one spell card. Uh, and maybe win? I don't know. We might not get any wins today. But yeah, thanks for joining me, guys. And I hope you're enjoying as much as I am.